Hey everyone, Camille here from ADA Fitness Training. Welcome back. Today I'm showing you five unique shoulder exercises guaranteed to take your shoulder day to the next level. So stay tuned, check it out. Are you tired of the same old boring shoulder presses and raises? Well, then you definitely want to stay around to check out today's video. I'm going to show you five very unique exercises that are not commonly done, yet still effective for growing those delts. So let's get into it. All right, first up, I'm going to show you a reverse grip shoulder press. So this is definitely a variation. Typically, your overhand with the barbell reaching straight up, straight down. Really great exercise for all three heads of the delts. So we're gonna flip the grip today and do an underhand grip. So I'll do a few and then we can talk about it. So just like that, straight up, squeezing those doubts back down, just like this. Now this is a very unique grip for the shoulder press. It puts a lot of activation on those front uh, part of the delt, which is great. So if that's an area where you're really trying to build up, then definitely check this reverse grip shoulder press out. It's guaranteed to blow up those delts. So if you were working this into a workout, I would definitely hit traditional shoulder press first and then round it out with a set of reverse grip. Or like I said, if front delts truly something that you're lacking and you're trying to grow that area, hit that reverse grip uh, shoulder press. All right, we're gonna show you another variation for the front delt, a single arm landmine shoulder press. So it's kind of an overhead press, but with the landmine attachment hooked up, we're gonna go straight up just like this. So you're getting a lot of tension in that front part of your delt. You're gonna to wanna to take your time, load up the weight if you can, but this is a great variation. You know, unlike the reverse grip shoulder press that we did previously, this one gives you that unilateral aspect, which is really great. So if you have one delt that's maybe lagging compared to the other, or maybe some type of strength imbalance, this single arm uh, landmine overhead press is a really great variation to work in. And then you can switch arms, obviously, just like this. So definitely give this a try. Most gyms have a landmine attachment. If not, you can always like put a barbell in a corner somewhere and do these as well. So grab your barbell, grab that lion mine attachment and hit that single arm overhead press, y'all. Up next, we're gonna blast those front delts and side delts with the Y raise. So for this one, you're gonna need an incline bench, about a 45 degree angle. We're gonna lay face down and we're just gonna bring the arms up into a Y, just like this, controlling it the entire time. Now, typically when you see people do delt raises on the incline, they're either doing front raises, which is predominantly the front delt, or they're doing rear delt flies like this. But there's a variation in between the Y raise. Now the Y raise puts a lot of activation on the front and side delt specifically, I know the mountain dog was a big advocate of the Y raise. In fact, he was like, if there's only two exercises you could do that would lead to delt, uh, increasing the size, the Y raise would be one of them. So definitely a great one to check out. If you're not used to doing it, you're definitely gonna feel those delts. So get those reps in, a good six to 12 is where it's at if we're trying to build up size. All right, so we've blasted those front delts. We got a little side delt in there. Now we're gonna to move to rear delt. We're gonna do a bent over rear delt cable fly. So I'm at the tower. We're gonna crisscross the arms here, just like that. And then we're gonna hinge at the waist about 90 degrees and bring those arms straight out. So I mentioned like on the incline, people do this on the bench with the dumbbells. But the beauty of doing this on the cables is that we've got constant tension now on those rear delts. And y'all, the rear delt is the most neglected muscle. So this is a really fantastic exercise. Get that deep stretch across those delts. What do me and James always say? 
Muscle stretch while under load, most potential for growth. So just like that, come up, really contract those delts, and then back down. There you have it, 12, six to 12 reps. That's where it's at. It's the rear delt cable fly. All right, and number five for you guys is gonna be a twist on the side delt raise, but we're gonna do them underhand. So turn those palms out and straight up and down, just like this. Typically when you see side delt raises, you see a neutral kind of palms in grip, and sometimes you'll see the pinkies up grip. I really don't like pinkies up grip, puts a lot of internal rotation on those shoulders, but a great variation if you haven't tried it is the underhand, kind of palms facing forward grip. You definitely feel this slightly different in your delts compared to the palms in grip. So definitely hit this grip, give it a try. It'll definitely recruit different muscle fibers that you're not used to recruiting, making it a very interesting variation. y'all how about a bonus i always love a good bonus all right i'm going to show you a really unique face pull it's actually from athlean x it's a modified face pull i've got the double rope here gives me a little extra range of motion i'm going to pull the rope to my face traditional face pull but we're not going to stop there i'm going to overhead press it y'all back down just like this this place is so much tension on those rear delts, it's incredible. They are engaged the entire time. So come back, give them a really good squeeze, keep them squeezed, and then press overhead. I guarantee you're not gonna be able to do that many reps at your normal face pull weight because this is extremely challenging, y'all. Just like this. All right, so there's your bonus. There's number six. So today we went through five really unique shoulder exercises guaranteed to give you some variety that you've been craving in that shoulder day. So number one, we start with the reverse grip, overhead shoulder press, y'all. So typically you have those kind of palms turned out in the overhead press, hits all three heads of the delts, but we're gonna flip the grip to the reverse grip, which is gonna put a whole lot more tension on this front part of the delt. So if you're looking to blow up those front delts, definitely try the reverse grip shoulder press. From there, we stuck with our front delt theme. We did the landmine single arm overhead press. It's a really great unilateral exercise. You get to work each arm independently. So if you're lacking strength in one side versus the other, or one delt's bigger than the other, this is a fantastic exercise to do. And even if you're perfectly symmetrical, it's a really great way to add that variety to your shoulder day. So grab that landmine uh, attachment in that barbell and get to that single arm shoulder press, y'all. All right, from there, we did one of the Mountain Dogs top exercises for delt growth, the Y raise. So we were on the incline bench with the dumbbells coming up into the Y. The Y raise is a really great one because it not only hits the front delt, but it hits the side delt as well. So it's two for one, y'all. So great, great exercise there. All right, from there, we grabbed a set of dumbbells and we did the reverse grip or palms forward side delt raises. So again, another really great side delt uh, exercise gives you that variation in variety because you're training those delts slightly different than normal. So if you're always doing that regular palms in grip or even that pinkies out kind of hands turned in grip, definitely try palms facing forward in that side delt raise. They're guaranteed to burn you, y'all. All right, and then from there, we added a bonus in there, the Athlean X face pull to shoulder press. Guaranteed to blow up those rear delts. So either grab a long rope or two ropes, even better, and grab it, do your traditional face pull, tension on the rear delt, and then overhead press while keeping that tension on those delts. All right, well, there you have it. Five really unique exercises guaranteed to blow up those shoulders and add some spice to that workout. If you've enjoyed this video, definitely check me and James out live every Sunday at 12 Eastern. We're there to answer any of your fitness and nutrition questions, so we would love it if you joined us. All right, y'all, if you love this video, definitely smash that like button, subscribe, and we'll catch you next time. All right, y'all, Camille, 88 Fitness Training.